all running around loose, plotting sedition against the state. Dear, oh dear, oh dear, we'd never sleep in our beds at night. Which will be the gist of the third cabinet reprimand to be issued to you, Controller Garden. All during your term of office. Yes, and they all count. And I've been instructed by my executive to request a full report of further developments in this matter for appending to our motion of censure on the Home Secretary for non-protection of our members. I, I, I would drop that. Really, if I were you, Ernest, you could end up looking more of a Herbert than Herbert. I mean, I can see the headlines now. State Union riddled with subversion. Executive powerless. Text. 377 members of a state union plotting sedition within a state factory itself. Are those figures accurate, no, Kyle? No, Home Secretary, they are not. Let's call it an educated guess. Quite a scandal, Ernest. And then, of course, there is the underground press and word of mouth. No, 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 I think you, uh, you would lose your job. I'd have to lend you my overalls. I should forget all about censure motions, Ernest. You see, you're going to need every friend you can get. Come to that, so is Herbert. You sound as if you've worked all this out, James. Always. Always. Would you care to punch up your waiting room, please? That man is a non-citizen. If his full citizenship was reinstated, he would give eyewitness testimony at a murder trial, a nice, quiet murder trial. Nothing else need come out. The extortionists would be convicted, and there would be the usual public hanging. And that reinstatement is the Home Secretary's absolute prerogative, Mr. Harrison, mine. Told you you'd need every friend you can get. Uh, Home Secretary, on consideration, uh, we may have been a trifle hasty in moving our motion of censure. We were not in possession of all the facts. Do you still insist that there is a book, Herbert? No, Kyle. At least not for the record. So, sweetness and light prevail. I only missed out on one thing. Demoting Inspector McRae to constable. And this is the last time you will be asked to help? Help, Herbert, is something that is freely given or not at all. You'll get no help from me, Kyle, but I have a feeling you won't be getting your job back after all. Well, on reflection, Home Secretary, I suppose help is a word that has passed out of our language as a request. Or even as a scream when you're drowning. Thank you.